Candle plant outside of Houston has been raging now for two days, going into its third day, creating an enormous plume of smoke, spreading for miles. Early this morning, a refinery exploding, sending massive flames and plumes of smoke into the air. People there told to shelter in place as hazmat and fire crews respond to the scene. The Center for Chemical Process Safety was established in 1985 by the American Institute of Chemical Engineers for the express purpose of assisting industry in preventing or mitigating process incidents in helping effectively manage process safety risks. More than 200 corporate members around the world drive the activities of CCPS today. This video has been produced to raise the awareness of major process safety incidents that have occurred in 2019 alone. In the CCPS book titled Guidelines for Investigating Process Safety Incidents, it states that one of the most significant roles of incident investigation is to prevent disasters by consistently examining and learning from more serious incidents. The Chemical Safety Board, who investigates the most serious incidents in the United States, has made formal recommendations to industry leaders to remind them to institute a cross-industry approach to the learning and sharing of lessons from significant process safety incidents. Therefore, the constant awareness of new incidents that are occurring in industry is of fundamental importance to our members. This video is just a small sample of 25 incidents that CCPS has identified as significant process safety incidents that have occurred around the world in the year 2019. In this presentation, you'll see major fire explosion and chemical releases we refer to as process safety incidents. Historically, the American Institute of Chemical Engineers, also known as the AICHE, has led efforts to improve process safety in the chemical, petroleum, and allied industries for more than six decades. AICHE formed the Center for Chemical Process Safety, known as CCPS, in 1985 after the tragic incidents in late 1984 in Mexico City in Bhopal, India. CCPS is chartered to develop and disseminate technical and leadership guidance and expertise to help prevent process safety incidents around the world. Here CCPS is highlighting from 2019 alone four of over 25 incidents spanning eight countries and 11 industries. Not a month went by without a significant incident. We started in Deer Park, Texas on March 18, 2019. A fire broke out at a petroleum products facility in the early morning hours and burned for three days, spreading to 11 tanks, causing local shelter-in-place orders and forcing schools and businesses to close until the order was lifted. The 2,650-acre facility is located on the Houston Ship Channel, about 24 miles east of downtown Houston. The plume of smoke moved from east to west across the Houston area and created a large haze over the city. The lack of rain and fog helped to keep the plume high above the ground. Shaquille Cadre, Executive Director and CEO of the Center for Chemical Process Safety and CCPS member companies alike, are committed to preventing process safety incidents and sharing lessons that are learned. Shaquille is concerned with the number of and the significance of the incidents that occurred in 2019. Now that we've taken a look at one of these incidents, let's see what Shaquille says about the 25 significant process safety incidents. CCPS wants to help the industry continually learn from incidents and to prevent them from reoccurring. This incident video is a new initiative at CCPS. Our intent is to share such highlights on a yearly basis to help the industry raise the sense of vulnerability. Our mission is to eliminate process safety incidents in all industries. By doing so, we protect people, property, and environment through collaborative effort. It is very important for all of us to learn and improve and share our learning to others to eliminate them in the future. 
Several of the losses have shown mechanical integrity related failures where fitness for service has been an issue. Fitness for service issue is important for all facilities to ensure process integrity. It becomes, however, much more critical as facilities are getting older. We all must stay abreast with the tools and techniques that are available to optimize mechanical integrity programs of our facilities to ensure that potential failures are detected before an actual mechanical failure. Process safety incidents are not unique to one country or industry, as we saw on September 28, 2019, when tragedy struck South Korea. An explosion occurred just before 11 a.m. on a 25,000-ton oil tanker that was docked at a pier. There were 25 Russian and Filipino sailors aboard the tanker when the explosion occurred. The fire spread to another oil tanker located nearby with 21 aboard. Fortunately, all sailors aboard both tankers were rescued but 18 were injured and some severely. CCPS is a global organization with nearly half of its membership from outside of the US. Over the last five years, CCPS has seen a strong growth in the membership globally. To expand our global process safety outreach with our members and beyond, CCPS held seven regional meetings and four regional conferences to promote awareness and share learning broadly. We believe that the collective process safety knowledge and learning from our global membership and key stakeholders have made CCPS the gold standard of process safety. Process safety incidents can impact any industry anywhere in the world, and it is our mission to eliminate them altogether. The summer of 2019 saw five major incidents in Texas alone. And then in November on Thanksgiving Day, another incident took place in Port Neches, Texas, at a petroleum processing plant located about 85 miles northeast of downtown Houston. An explosion rocked the processing unit at 1 a.m. A second blast occurred about 12 hours later. Three of the 30 workers were injured at the petrochemical plant when the first explosion happened. Authorities evacuated a four-mile radius around the plant. Perhaps the most significant incident for the United States in 2019 was at the largest and oldest refinery on the East Coast. On June 21st, tragedy struck an oil refinery in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. At 4 a.m., a single explosion rattled the refinery and lit up the night sky with huge balls of gas and flame, injuring five people. According to the Deputy Fire Commissioner, the source of the fire was a tank of butane, one of the products that comes from refining crude oil. On October 16, 2019, the U.S. Chemical Safety Board released a factual update into the June 21st explosion and fire. The CSB factual update notes that a pipe elbow, which had corroded to about half the thickness of a credit card, appears to have ruptured in the refinery's hydrofluoric acid, or HF, alkylation unit. The leaking process fluid formed a large ground-hugging hydrocarbon vapor cloud that included over 5,000 pounds of the highly toxic HF. Two minutes later, the cloud ignited, causing a massive fire and explosion. Because most industrial facilities don't have a history of major incidents, there's a tendency to think, it just won't happen to me. So what is CCPS doing to increase awareness, propagate learning, and promote process safety performance around the world? At CCPS, we've been creating global solutions to process safety challenges since we started in 1985, and we serve as a worldwide resource for process safety information. We've published over 130 books that cover a variety of topics on process safety, including risk-based process safety, which is a cornerstone of our philosophy. In addition to these things, CCPS and AICHE Academy are producing undergraduate education materials for chemical engineering students and their professors on the fundamentals of process safety, which better prepare them for entrance into the workforce. We believe every incident can be prevented and have been promoting the concept of maintaining a sense of vulnerability that incidents can and do happen. 
this video will help to maintain the sense of vulnerability and increase awareness in industry of the incidents and their impacts. Process safety management is an investment in the future that every industry needs to make. It's not just for large sites or multinational corporation, it's for all facilities that use or manufacture hazardous materials. Each of these incidents are tragedies that have far-reaching effects on companies, employees, and the society that depends on them to produce value-added products. We at CCPS believe these incidents can be prevented, and our members are committed to working together to be stronger, smarter, and more effective in the ongoing effort to reduce these incidents to zero.